short and this is our project. Ow. Every 6.8 million, million people report to the ER room due to suspected fractures, just like this guy. As a matter of fact, it's the average person will experience two fractures in their lifetime. The fracture is caused when the bone isn't able to support the energy force behind it. The most common cause of fractures is trauma-related injuries, such as motor vehicle accidents, or sport injuries, as well. According to Beth Van Auken, an ER nurse that we interviewed from Shawnee Mission Medical Center, says falls due to ice are especially common this time of year. If you think you may have a limb fracture, it is important to keep that area still or mobilized immediately to prevent the bones from moving and causing bad alignment or from damaging the arteries and nerves. The current practice is to apply a temporary splint to the injured area where it will be removed in the ER for further evaluation and x-rays, but removal of the splint can cause a lot a lot of pain with increased swelling and muscle spasm. Our team, One Bit Short, has, <coughs> has a new innovative solution to treating lung fractures, which we have presented to our local paramedics. It is called Bone Balls. Are you sick and tired of those flimsy splints that don't protect your limb fractures? You deserve better. Buy Bone Balls. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Billy Alvarez here with Bone Bone. <laughs> bone foam is a pre-polymer carbon mix that comes in a can and can be used by anyone. Apply by spraying the injured area, making certain that you cover the joints above and below the suspected pressure. You can then easily mold it around the area you're trying to cover. It's quick setting, lightweight, comfortable, and can be left on for extra. Bone foam contains a newly discovered crystallite graphite carbon which allows the bone foam to adjust as swelling occurs in your limb. It also contains antiseptic to prevent infections as well as a painkiller to provide you with immediate pain relief. Ordinary splints are a mess! <laughs> X. With bone foam, you just aim, squeeze, and apply. It's easy! Since it is applied directly to the skin, bone foam should not be used for longer than three days, or skin breakout can occur. If a longer term solution such as a cast is needed, the bone foam can be easily moved to the hospital. Bone foam can contribute to healing limb fractures, limb energy faster, to provide immediate and longer mobilization than a splint. It can also be applied by anyone. It's important to see a doctor after bone foam is applied to have your injury evaluated. And with a, with a cast, if you experience numbness, tingling, or cold or blue fingers or toes, Remove the bone foam immediately and call 911. It is intended for limb fractures only. Now let's help this poor guy. <laughs> yes, I like this more order bone foam with express delivery. <laughs> wow, guys, thanks. I feel a lot better now. <clears throat> okay, let's go to the NCR. The ER now. <laughs> Four minutes.